Hey guys, so today I have a full meme deck for you and well, this deck used to be a thing, well it used to be a meme thing back in like half a year ago, but I wanted to revisit it and it's actually not that terrible, it's, well it's super bad, but it uh, actually won a few games. Uh, it is bad and the problem of the main problem of this deck is that it cannot win round one, it's like super low tempo plays and cannot win any round one but if you manage to make your opponent pass in round two and you go in round three then you can win a lot because you create actually quite a lot of points so how this deck works first of all you want to a little bit of fin with artorius impera brigade and roach etc this is just to help you maybe secure round one or play something in round one uh, then you want to use your falcon trouble tra troubadours on like Iron Falcon Infantry if you like if you need an engine and on Living Arbor if you need if you want more points for the future. So then you go to round two, you want to pass or like make your pray that your opponent will pass, and then the fun begins. So in the perfect let's talk about perfect situation. So perfect situation. You play your Fifon and you hide behind him. So easy, you play in the range row and you are safe to go. You slam your Wagenburgs, so you will gain more armor uh, in the future. But why you want to slam them? You slam living armor next to Wagenburg and it makes your living armor grow. Then you slam Leto King Claire into living armor. It instantly goes to 10, so this is instantly 10 point. And if it's next to Wagenburg, then it's gonna grow and grow and grow and grow. Then finally, you have some nice small combos of like uh, Asire into Roach, then Vivienne for some points. But you want to slam German Piquen in the melee row for Chaos, and then you slam Alchemist into Chaos and Living Armor. So how this work? How this works? Alchemist uh, change the uh, power from Living Armor into the Cow, but Living Armor power cannot be changed because it always stays as an uh, armor. So it stayed, uh, stays at 10 or whatever number it is now and your cow is gonna get boosted by this amount of points. So this basically means that your alchemist can be basically uh, 4 boosted by like 10, 12, etc. So this is quite nice and the more the, the more armor it has from cards like Wagenburg and uh, Troubadours, the more power it will transfer to cows and other units. Of course, you can play it on other units, etc. And strategic withdrawal is basically to do it more times. So we want more alchemists, more things, and more units will be big. Of course, the problems are like Igiel and Tolrumi, Tol removal, but you don't talk about it. So that's pretty much the deck. Remember, the Gascon is just because it's a bandit, but remember it he can hire all some cards like uh, Troubadour or uh, Infantry, of course. And also it's a nice tech choice because like around 50% of the chance you can roll a movement, remove armor or something like this, whatever you need. This deck is fun. When it works, it looks great and I will show you one game from it, but most of the time it will. It won't work. So... If you like it, please drop a like, follow, etc. And if not, like, stay safe and play Gwent. Thank you very much for coming, and I will see you next time. Of beams. Now I'm making a little bit too good cards, or too do, could do too good decks, or too Mimi decks that are just not working. So, yeah, I'm out out of ideas as well. I need an expansion. But uh, the thing is, on Thursday, I'm going away with my friends for a trip. So I will have a few days of rest. So maybe when I come back, I will have another energy to play more Gwent. Well, I still like the game. Don't get me wrong. It's just a little bit stale. Maybe I can play Arena like tomorrow. Mm -hmm. 
I need to play one gold in this round, so it will be Artorius. Like. Yeah, I'm like... <laughs> unless my opponent, unless my opponent as well is not playing something uh, out of meta, I'm so... <sighs> bored. Like, see... I'm like, I'm seeing a Mystic Echo and I'm like, uh, I don't even want to think about it. Like, uh, fine. I know that you're gonna slam these shit tons of points. Uh, uh, but what can I do? What is truth if not an illusion? Ooh, I can boost it by five with Vivian. Amazing. Maybe I can play the arena again. Yolo. Easy pass. Okay, this pass was probably game losing, but we'll be fine. Mystic Echo is fine. <laughs> okay, what do we want here? Uh, these are good. Maybe we can swap this. Uh, sure. He won't. Like, he should. He, he would probably 2 owe me. Right? You should 2 owe me. You should try to 2 owe me. Or maybe I should have played something smaller. Just to make him pass. Sometimes you need to do these mind games, like play something worse just to make your opponent pass. Movement. Ugh. Oh no, 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 fuck, 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 that was incorrect. I should have buffed this just to slam it now. Ah, uh, shit. That was a, that was a wrong target. That was bad. Oh wait. Wait. I can give him three points again. <laughs> Whoops. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> Oops. Whoops. Yeah, I'm gonna give him two points again. <laughs> that was on purpose. Whoops. Whoops. He didn't use Echo yet, by the way. Interesting. Nice. So, what can we do? We can slam this, right? Vivienne into... on this. So it's nine. Ugh. 
9 plus 10, 11. 29, sure. Is this enough? This is 6, not enough. No, not enough. We only have secrets of one thing. <coughs> yeah. 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 Maybe he doesn't run removal. Okay, I need stuff. At least I have defender. Okay, this is stuff. This is actually stuff. Oof, this is stuff. <clears throat> I don't have anything to swap yet. I didn't draw my cows. But it's gonna be fine anyway. I need this to on range, so I slam this on range. Oh, I have this. Rowdy Dwarf. Okay, it's fine. Okay, 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 okay. Pee -pee 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 -pee. This is fine. If he cannot remove this, this is more than fine, even. And I can slam Wagenburg now, so I get more armor. Interesting. No, 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 no. Don't poison me. God damn you. I'm still gonna slam this. I have one Imperial Diviner and I have Strategical Withdraw. So this is fine. This is fine. See, this is fine. Now I'm gonna put Lito here, unless he plays uh, Poison, then I, well, then I'm still gonna play Lito, because I'm gonna Imperial Diviner into Strategical Withdraw, into Leto, is easy. <clears throat> oh yeah, you forgot about your plan. Like, I don't care, this deck doesn't care what he plays. Look at this amazing play. <clears throat> By the way, there is no reason to play Mystic Echo now. Oh, well. Unless I have like deck hey, uh, graveyard removal, maybe I have. Yeah, okay. I take it back. Look at this. But that's not the end. <clears throat> okay, my Imperial Diviner is doing nothing, but it's fine. Look at these points. Igni is not a thing, remember. Igni is not a thing. Oh yes, oh yes, oh yes, it's gonna be great. Okay, he's getting shit tons of points, but I'm gonna get shit tons of points as well. Uh, this first, right? He's gonna buff, so it's actually playing around Igni somehow. A lot of points, a lot of points, a lot of points, 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 points. Don't oak me. No. Well, it doesn't matter. Well, it matters if he has Igni, then it very matters. There's been a mistake. I'm no mage. If he has an Igni. La 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 la. He doesn't run Igni. No, 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 no. Who will play in harmony Igni? See, no one is playing Igni in harmony. Oh. So. This is beautiful. No one runs Igni. No, you are not playing Igni. This is not an Igni. I repeat, this is not an Igni deck. He has a Gnome. His last card is a Gnome. See? 
Easy. Clap. Clap to this deck. <laughs>